Hello everyone, Fantastic here, and in this video I want to show you guys the beach farm in Stardew Valley. From the description we can learn that it has good foraging and fishing, since there's a lot of ocean, obviously, and tons of open space. Sometimes supply crates wash up on the shore, that's cool. However, sprinklers don't work in the sandy soil. So that sprinklers thing is going to be a really big deal, because as you can see, a huge proportion of the beach farm is in fact sandy. So if I come over here to the left a bit, we can take the hoe tool and you can see that you can still dig with the hoe. So all of this land, everything that is the light sand is still going to be growable for your crops. However, this border area where it's really close to the water, that is not. So wet sand is ungrowable. So the problem with this setup is that you won't be able to use the sprinklers to water these plants. So whenever you grow your crops, you're going to have to always do it manually with the watering can. Now, if you don't already know, you can upgrade the watering can several times to make it so that you can water a large area at a time. So it won't be the biggest deal, but it is going to mean that later in the game, you're going to have to water your crops manually. Okay, so let's explore around a bit. When we hit M to go into map mode, you can see the beach farm here in the same location as any of the farms are. Just like always, you have a path that goes up, a path that goes to the right, and a path that goes down for exploring the rest of the town. So the up path is located right here. Right next to this cave, which later is going to be used for growing mushrooms. Across this little walkable sandy beach path, uh, this I believe becomes the greenhouse later in the game. And then over here on the top left, you have a little shrine that's used for some in-game events as well. So as we go south on the farm, you'll just notice that a huge proportion of everything is that sandy area. But there is one zone down here where you can grow crops normally. So this is just standard dirt. So you would be able to use sprinklers here for automatically growing certain crops. But compared to every other map, that's going to be severely limiting. We can come down here a little bit more to the south. A small freshwater pond there. If we go even further down, we come across this little bridge thing. I actually don't know if this is used for anything or it's simply a fishing dock, but if you actually want to go south to the town, you just have to go a little bit further over to the right. By the way, this random trash that you can find on several areas of the beach seems to be completely unremovable. None of the tools seem to do any damage to it. So that may end up being a mild annoyance. And then here you have the path that goes south into the town, just through those trees right there. Okay, so now we can loop back around to the top right of the farm. As you can see, mostly just dealing with a lot of sandy areas. And then we finally get up here to the top right, the little cat slash dog watering bowl. And then here is the right path that through the trees you can go into the town area. So that's pretty much the beach farm in a nutshell. As you can see digging through here, there's still going to be a lot to clean up for your farm. So some people out there are calling the beach farm a hard mode. And I don't think that's necessarily untrue because using sprinklers to grow crops is a really solid strategy for earning money in the game. But the fact that it might be a little bit trickier to do normal farming might encourage trying other methods in the game, such as specializing in fishing, even though that's not necessarily one of the more profitable professions in the game. So that's pretty much going to be it for this video, taking a look at the beach farm. It's really pretty to look at, and I think it's going to be great for returning players looking for a change of pace or for anyone who just kind of wants a tropical island vibe to their farm.